Bioluminescence may be rotating out of nature, Shaman, but Druid is stepping up as the next class to be ruling spell damage in Hearthstone. To be honest, I'm not really sure if a lot of people are gonna like this kind of deck, but I love it. There's a reason why I do not do card reviews in Hearthstone. It's because I don't want to look like an idiot whenever I'm judging cards that I have no idea are going to be good or bad. And one of the cards that I was probably going to say was gonna be bad is the card out al al allowness, al alun I'm just gonna call owl i don't care make fun of me go ahead and say clark hellscream can't say the owl word in chat i don't care go ahead and do it because i'm too busy dealing 66 damage with this card that's right you heard me correctly now i don't believe this is the the best way of playing this deck and that's why i have two different owl combos that i'm going to be showing you guys that can really utilize the spell damage combo to its best capabilities this is my list this is the one that i came up with the first deck that i played was very similar to the calligrapho artist deck that we were already playing with Ragnaros and uh, Stoneborn General. But Stoneborn General, the 8-8 eight, eight that summons another 8-8 eight, eight with the Death Rattle, that card is rotating, so what we need is another win condition. So I just decided to slot in the Owl because we're already playing cards like Living Roots and Seedlings anyway. So we have we have spell damage if we need it, as well as Minion Generation and cards like Cactus Construct can help us build up a gigantic board. But this is pretty much just a very simple linear Druid of just ramp up quickly, have a board, play Calligrapho, either kill them with Rag or with the Owl, but the rest of the deck is trying to support this sort of owl combo as best as you can. Because in the situations to where you do top deck your owl, you really don't have a lot of options. So I really don't believe this is the best way of playing the deck. But if you want a deck that's just very simple in order to get started with this archetype, then maybe this is a good way of starting about it. But if you want my official recommendation, I would suggest playing this deck from Fino that feels a lot more solid. But Fino said that this deck was a little bit slow and unfortunately didn't really feel that good in his game. Games. so definitely take this with a with a grain of salt there might be an owl tk like shattered druid that might be really really good but keep in mind that all the decks that you're going to be seeing until the release date all have 10 new cards in the expansion so we really can't evaluate these kind of archetypes yet because we don't know what's really going to be the best because people aren't trying to win they're trying to not you know they're trying to make sure that they get invited to the next theory craft stream so people are playing for fun but these decks are not a clear indication of what's going on and honestly i find that really really exciting because content creators get to play for fun versus trying to break the meta and do all of this sweaty behavior in order to break hearthstone on the very first day so that way they have the best view it, it, it really doesn't matter in my opinion what matters is having fun in hearthstone and an owl deck can actually be very fun but if this ends up becoming the new combo deck people don't really like me when i play nature shaman and uh people aren't gonna like being otk'd for 66 damage if this deck is very very consistent but i have games coming up with both of these decks in case you are curious about the archetype and you are an owl stand go ahead and tell me in the comments on how exactly you pronounce this card because i am embarrassed i, I think okay i think it's alonius right alonius like lioness but like an owl so alonius he's all alone so he needs us haha <laughs> Yeah. There we go. We're, we're going we're gonna to protect this little guy. We're going to make sure he's not alone. And don't forget, if you do enjoy this kind of content, feel free to like this video and subscribe to the YouTube channel to be notified about any of our future updates. We've also got a Patreon in case you guys want deck optimizations, coaching, or shout outs in future videos, some extra perks and bonuses for supporting the content. But thank you so much for making it to the end of this deck intro, and we'll see you for the next video. So here, here's my next idea. All right. How about, how about we just surprise you guys instead of telling you what's going to happen? All right. What if I surprise you? A lot of a lot of priests, man. I, I literally predicted this. I said there were gonna be so many priest players. I literally said there'd be so many priest players. All right, I'm gonna go for maximum uh, maximum uh, ramp. Really? Okay, you know. Let's discover a card, right? Okay, discover a card. So this is gonna be a weird deck. It's gonna be a really weird deck. It's a calligrapho combo. We got it. We got it. We got the uh, the cauliflower combos. All right, this is looking really good. So Dru Druid Ramp is supposed to be weaker, right? Druid Ramp is supposed to be weaker, y'all. Yeah? Oh wow, this tempo, tempo king, dude. Definitely not picking that. Pick this, because now we have. Uh... Oh wait. Oh wait a minute. Wait, I shouldn't have picked that. No, I should have picked the. Uh... Oh God, what what else was there? There was the owl, and there was something else that was much better. That, yeah, that, because I can. Yeah, I need that. 
All right, so it's turn four, and Drew, it's still at nine mana, guys. It's, it's, uh... <laughs> How does Rogue look so far? So far, it looks pretty good. I've only seen it like twice, though. But I slaughtered it with Warlock. I'm not gonna lie, dude. Wheel of Death goes hard. It is It is actually an you know, Omega powerful card. Okay, hold on a minute. Can I maybe win this next turn? Hmm. Stop it now. Wait, does, does this legit just win next turn? What turn is this? I, I really just want to hit Calligrapha. I, I, I want to hit um Owl. I got to hit Owl, bro. Like, Rag is also a good option, but I think Owl actually ends it, right? It's turn five going into my turn six, I think. Turn six, Owl, OTK, if we, if we hit the 50-50. Top deck Rag, bro. Top deck Rag every time. And if we see a diamond portrait, it could be either one. Owl me, dude? Come on! It doesn't... Dude, the, I, the, I, don't, I wanted to see the owl interaction. Oh, come on! The owl actually ended it, dude. I guess I should I, I guess I should have killed one of his minions still. Maybe maybe rag high rolls. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one, mate. What owl? It's a it's the one of the new legendaries in uh the, the Whizbang set. It like doubles your spell damage. And it's like I, I don't even know what the damage would have been on this. That's why I wanted to see it. I, I don't know how the card calculates. Cause like what if the double 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 doubles, you know? I don't know what living roots would be at. Yeah, the yeah, owl guy, man. Calligrapho to owl. This could be like crazy. At the same time, we also just have Rag, so you know, Rag is at least doing his job right now. I, 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 it's kind of funny that I'm disappointed in Rag, even though Rag's probably still gonna win the game. You talking one shot from Moonfire? Pretty much. Pretty much. All right. So how do we? Ooh, how do we kill him? How do we guarantee kill him? Is there a way to make that happen? I can't hit this with hero powers, so we gotta discover a card from the deck first. Deal two. We just gotta focus on removing stuff. I think adding another rag is just unnecessary. dead anyway come on rag go for the lethal ah damn it ah, i guess i shouldn't have traded <laughs> i guess i shouldn't have traded how did he kill me man how does he kill me from here i'm really mad that owl couldn't just end it but dude like this is just pow like i just proved that ramp druid could still work <laughs> didn't i call this what that druid would still be good yeah yeah i i said i i said i i wouldn't i wouldn't be surprised I didn't see how it would happen, but then I sat down with the cards and I and I found a way to make it happen. I'm still I'm still killing it, kill, still killing it with Druid, man. Amen Thul, Amen Lul, Amen Lul. <laughs> didn't they just keep Wild Growth in and it still costs three? Yeah, it does with with Malfurion's gift, but you wanna know what I did? I discounted it with um. With life binders on two. Wait a minute, he's got a rat. No. 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 Wait a minute, no. There ain't no way. There ain't no way. There ain't no way, bro. I told you there's no way. There uh, quite literally ain't no no possibility of that ever happening. Cause Rag loves me, you hear? Rag Rag loves me. Now, now kill him, Rag. Rag, come on. Kill him. Rag, kill him. Rag, you... Rag, you need to kill him. Rag, you need to kill him. Thank you. Oh, my God. Okay, imagine if we would have... If, if we... <laughs> All right, good rag. Good rag. Can't spell a rainbow without frog. Listen 
to the drip, drip, drip. All right, hold on a minute. Oh, whoops. Oh, whoops. Hold on. That's not how you spell it. That's how you spell it. There we go. Now it's working. I feel like I always have to save this. I guess, okay, wait. What is Fino doing? What is Fino doing? Gotta respect Chump for cooking the worst cards uh, of the uh, of the expansion. I don't I don't think they're the worst cards at all, man. Like we went up against that deck earlier, and it legitimately slapped my meat. It had an insane turn four where it played the giant. It drew twenty cards by turn four. I would not underestimate any deck. I would not underestimate any deck that could draw twenty cards by turn four. Cause that just finds you options, man. All right, so depending on... If he just plays, like, a ramp card, I'm just playing the Acolyte every time, man. Acolyte and the crop is just uh, so much damage. Any problem. Okay, wait a minute. This almost never survives, right? I feel like I have to do this. I might get punished for this. But I feel like I have to do this. Oh, no, he's got swipe. Damn, bro. Okay, all right, all right, all right. That was bad. That was bad. At least they give me card draw. This is like the only card draw on my deck. Okay, now I have to do this. Figuring out this deck is going to have to figure out the perfect blend of spells and minions. But then again, maybe I just... Ah, I should have gotten rid of this. It was high risk, high reward. Giveaway soon, Clark? It might happen. It might not. It depends on how I'm feeling. The giveaway is almost five minutes away. It could be. It could be. It could be in five minutes or in 20 subs. I haven't decided yet. Based on what I've seen, which decks look the best? Wheel Warlock looks dummy good. Wheel Warlock looks omega dummy good. And in, in this uh in this rule set. It's very important to have that caveat. Because like with with uh with this deck in particular, or like with, with this meta in particular, we gotta keep in mind that everyone's playing 10 new cards. Not everyone is just going to start playing 10 new cards into the next expansion. There's probably going to be, like, a couple of cards that go into, like, already meta-relevant decks. So, figuring out the best deck for that is going to be fun and challenging, in my opinion. Okay, so, I know this looks weird, but I want Mon Pa to start gaining life against a Druid. So, here we go. Now we know, now we know the reason why they made Mon Pa 1-8 to begin with. Because they saw hand buff in the future, and they're like, eh, maybe, maybe 1 HP is the way to go. Oh, no, there's cluster. Ah, oh, shit. All right, so we'll go ahead and just get rid of that. All right, we're getting a lot of value. We are getting a lot of value here, dude. Look at how look at how large my minions are. Like I gotta worry about Reno and stuff, but aside from that, Wheel of Death is not a meme card. No, it's not a meme card. You wanna know why? Because Warlock has so many ways of not taking fatigue that the drawback of the card is really not that much of a drawback. Oh, he's doing Ian Arc. Oh, dude, I'm getting Ian Ard. Oh God. Oh, jeez, dude. Yeah, Ian Ard Drew would go hard. Okay, hold on a minute. Is there like a... Oh, wait. Grimy into crop rotation. Is there like a way for me to get Reska on the field too? Can we watch the coin? Okay, yes. Thank thank you, Ultikon. I li okay, I saw that video pop up in my recommends and I specifically didn't watch it because I, that I, I knew I was going to watch it on stream. Could you put the link in chat? Yeah, poison is crop 100% the way to go. And I can't trade the 2-6, so... Like, what is he building towards is the question. Like, what is, what is the reason of drawing for the deck? Man. Killing the ENR to stop healing really didn't matter. What mattered was killing this in order to stop the draw. But it doesn't look like that's gonna happen. Alright, well. Like, Reno just. Oh my god, dude. Reno destroys. It. Whoa, what? This one's a tribute! Hello? 
do we do it, Fino? The beauty of nature. Am I dead? At 42? Oh my god, I'm so dead, aren't I? I mean, how much is this gonna be dealing? Oh my god! Wow. Oh, uh, wow. God, God damn. God damn, Vino. God, God damn. Okay, so discover a card. All right, come on. Fingers crossed, man. Fingers crossed. That's right. No, mi no minions. Only minion one of draws is a cauliflower. I, I don't know what it is with me and drawing patches, but I keep drawing patches. Like, why? All right, hold on a minute. Discover a card for my deck. Uh, it's probably got just, just, mm. I need the, uh, I honestly, I want all these cards. Um, we're playing this on three every time. I think I just got to go with the cluster, right? Because ramp is just so important. If we end up top decking wild growth next turn, any good mill decks in this expansion? Uh, I don't really think there's any mill mechanics, is there? I'm not really sure. All right, so we got the cauliflower now. This is a very specific meme combo I am trying to pop off here. Very, very simple. Okay, there's swipe. We could just swipe that, but it's absolutely not worth it. All right, unfortunately, we just don't have a turn here. Like, maybe we could have done this. Maybe, but I feel like I just want to go for maximum spell damage and see what happens. Because honestly, it's looking like we have to, like, do this... Well, do this into this, do this. It spends three, puts me back up to ten. Swipe is not good enough. Yeah, the Fino. Oh my god, let's go. Okay, uh, the Fino deck is probably the way to play this list, in all honesty. It's a good thing this guy's deck is omega slow right now. Because then I can play Cluster. We might actually have this pretty soon. If I could top deck like a like a living roots or something, like that's four owls. Wish I got a taunt from this, but dude, he's just so slow. That's the thing about Hunter drawing cards. This song is great. Uh, this song is called Chimera by Polyphia. Chimera by Polyphia. Here's the link. Oh my god, there's the living roots. Oh my god, there's the living roots, bro. Oh my god, there's the living roots. Oh my god, don't fail me now, man. Oh my god, game, don't fail me now. Give me, give me, um... I might have an innervate in this deck. I might have an innervate in this deck. I just don't have a way of like going omega wide. Okay, hold on a minute. I'm pretty sure that this is lethal as long as I don't top deck the owl. All right, come on. So we have to do it this way. Everyone could use a fresh coat of paint. <laughs> Yo, who's gonna clip that? Who, who wants to clip that, dude? We did it first try. Well, that's the second try. Okay, all right, that's the second try. That's the second try. But there you go, man. That was only four. That was only four, dude. <laughs> like, this ramp scam, like, this ramp scam druid. It's still good. It's, the, it's literally the exact same deck as the Calligrapho Rag, but we put in Owl and a couple spell damage cards. <laughs>